All right, it's Friday, and on Arc Cincinnati, that means we are about to draw the news. Are you so excited? I'm so excited. I can tell you love it so much. How about I, I start? I do love it. It is super fun. It's so fun, but I'm just terrible. No, you're not. Yes. No, you're not. We, you have unfortunately made some some picks out of the hat here. Yeah. That have put you in some very difficult positions. Yeah. Um, and we'll just and leave I'm it sure at that. I'm sure it'll happen today, too. If we're lucky. Okay, yeah. here we go. Okay. Oh, look who's hat. It's a Peyton Lemonade stand hat. Uh, this is going to be, this is. Creel, you got to help me. Okay. Be my friend today. <sighs> Always, okay. but yep. especially today. Okay. Okay, we're ready. We're ready. Ooh, a cylinder. You told me. Well, you have to be careful. Okay. Spam. Uh, sushi, walking sushi. Um, mm, going in the cup. Mm. <laughs> nope, I don't like that. <laughs> Not great. Not great at all. Table. Is it a table? Can you give me any? On hockey rink. Oh, Bob. This is rough. Oh, Olympics? Oh. They were just here yesterday. Chuck. Oh, the little kid drummer. <laughs> that is correct. That's the little kid drummer. Thank you, Chuck. Chuck nailed it. Chuck nailed it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So if, if you didn't happen to catch yesterday, you really missed something and you need to get on YouTube. Uh, go to the Local 12 YouTube channel and you can undoubtedly find it. So Frankie. The Drummond two-year-old. The cutest thing you'll ever see. Oh, my gosh. One of our, our favorite guests, not just of this week, but really, I think, since Ark Cincinnati began. Two years old. Big Dave Grohl, Foo Fighters guy. Uh, dad is a drummer as well. And Frankie has picked the drums right up. Those are his blue drumsticks, by the way, which he pointed out to us. Uh, his parents joined us on set as well to talk about it. Now, I was at the concert last night. I did not, I Frankie, Frankie did not get up on stage, but I think Frankie would have done great by the way, um, but very good. That was, that was okay. Um, what part was, what, what was the least great part about what I did? The drum. I think I, he had a drum set. Yes, I should have. Multiple I, I drums. I should have done a cymbal. Yeah, a I was, cymbal I don't know, like table, food, something came and I to almost, mind. I almost drew a musical note, but I feel like musical notes, like numbers and letters, are unfair. Yeah. Like, I think, I feel like as soon as you do that, it's. It, okay, I gotcha. Tanner says he would have allowed musical note. But I just, you know, it feels cheap. It cheapens the thing. I just hit my elbow, by the way. Really hurt. <laughs> Sent, you know how you, when you hit it and it just shoots down your arm? My, my fingertips are oh, tingling. Great. Yeah, that'll be fine. You can do the rest you of the show. you got to stay alive at You'll least until 10. I didn't know if you had to <laughs> hold it for me to grab it to make it. Oh, jeez. Chuck. You ready? This is, we always have this. Okay. Well, we don't have the perfect colors here. I'm, oh, but I, honestly, the markers, having different colors okay. with the markers has made a huge difference. Okay. Huge difference. We are going to. Okay. It's a person. It's an apple. Do... It's an orange. It's, it's a person with longer hair, long, beautiful hair, long, flowing hair. It's the mullet kid we just talked about. It's Griffey. And that's too long on top. Too long on top. That's not businessy enough on top. That's another person whose hair is a different color. Joe Burrow's haircut. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that there suave. You go. Went from that hey. to that. Very good. It actually worked See? today. See, it's very good. I'm, I'm sure you haven't heard this story. No. <laughs> no, it's, it, it isn't a national story or anything. No. Joe Burrow buzzes his hair after weeks of rumors. Joe Burrow showed up to training camp sporting a bleach blonde buzz cut. Apparently, the new look was made mostly um, out of the fact that his look like maybe this doesn't finish the sentence, but I think it was because he was bored. His, that, that was it. He was bored. That's what he, he said. Well, I think it's a bad breakup. This is what you do if you have a breakup. Well, wait a minute. That's not you what change that's your not hair what when you have a breakup. He didn't. He didn't say that. I don't know if him and his girlfriend broke up, but he there were rumors that. that they he broke up again. According to Burrow, B.J. Hill, we mentioned this off the top, made a bet, and we've got to wait to see if that bet is going to actually come through. You're hilarious, by the way. You're welcome. I thought it was really well done. Like, okay. I knew as soon as you went from one to the other, I knew it immediately. Okay, good. I knew it immediately. See? I was going to draw football. See? But we draw football every week. All the week. time. No, I, I appreciate so I, I, you. I kept that away. Going okay. much like the musical note thing. You're like, you know what? I'm, gonna, I'm not doing it that way. We're playing real fair today. Right. That's right. Okay. Here we go. Next. Tanner. 
Okay. Is this really hard? I think it's going to be. Oh, great. Not from a drawing standpoint. Just because it's me? No, because <laughs> you needed to really have been... Paying attention? And you love sports so much. Oh, I do love sports. Because you're like, the, the, the sports part, the reason I feel like I can say that without giving it away is because I'm going to do this immediately. Oh, baseball. Okay. Well. Baseball's big in my house. Okay. I obviously know that. It's got to be something with Ellie, right? Because he's like the only one that makes the news right now. <laughs> Other than maybe Jonathan India stealing, stealing more bases. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yes. I totally. That's enough. I am giving her that. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Tanner says that's fine. Oh my gosh. Yes. You were so fast. That was really good. Okay, so Ellie. The only other thing I was thinking was Jonathan India being traded is the only <laughs> other thing we've heard. Which is another thing that we have heard. Yes. Look at you. I like the red. Just yeah. nail it. Ellie De La Cruz reached yet another milestone. He stole uh, second in the game against Atlanta, and that particular stolen base already put him at 50 on the season. He has more than that now. He's insane. Yeah, Ellie is the second Reds player since 1906 with at least 50 steals in the first 102 games of a season. Eric Davis uh, had 57 at that point in 1986. He's Eric the amazing. Red, one of my yeah, it's funny. Down at the ballpark last night at the concert, I, yeah. I, I was I was talking to one of the fellows who was showing us where our seat was. And you know, he's down there for all the Reds games. Right. And he just said, you just he just does things. He said, I've watched baseball my whole my whole life. He said he just does things that you've never seen anybody do before. Right. You know, in baseball. And but you know what I think about is he changing the game. Yes. You know what I mean? Because I think he is. Especially stealing bases. Speed. He's doing things that have, have, haven't happened since 1900. Correct. And so he's, he's changing the game. And he's so got how is that going to play in the years to and come? And when you're you know? that fast, you don't always have that kind of power. He's got both. Yeah. You Ugh. know what I mean? Which is just And he's so tall. Crazy. I know. I know. I don't, I don't, he just amazes me every time I, every time I've watched him and I love it too because every single person, young or old, picking up their phone to be able to watch history. And I think it's that brought a lot more cool. young people to the game. Yeah, uh, my know, kids are obsessed. Yep, yep. Oh. <laughs> oh. I got bonus points if I don't, well. Uh, well. Hmm. Shoot, shoot, wow. shoot. We know how we know how important bonus points are in draw the news. <laughs> but if I do it, it will immediately give it away. So okay. Okay, here, 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 here. Okay. Mm. We so we have both intentionally made this more difficult on ourselves <laughs> when we true. did not have to today. It is true, but I always end up. I don't want to yeah, have anything inappropriate come out when it's not. I know when it's not. That, when that's not what you're going for. Which this we never a, would be. It's a family program on broadcast television at 8 o'clock uh, in the morning. Ma, 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 ma. But the internet, you dirty dogs. <laughs> I'm gonna do it, but it is. There's no intention. There's no. There's no. Do you want me to stand in front of it until you're done? You tell me when it's ready. They don't deserve to see it. <laughs> Is it okay? Can I move now? Yeah. Okay. Oh, that clears it right up for me. <laughs> Is it the Eiffel Tower? Yes. <laughs> what the heck? With, what's it for? The Olympics? Yes! Well, what's the, what is this? What's happening there? I was there? trying to be <laughs> What is going on there? Because you know there's crisscrosses all through it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's gold now. <laughs> He <laughs> told me I couldn't draw the rings. I couldn't draw the rings. My next thing was going to be a volleyball because they're playing volleyball right right in front of here. Yeah, I just I literally I thought you did. I thought you did like this. So that like nobody, no, no. Like nobody would think it was anything that it shouldn't be. No. <laughs> if you look at that. <laughs> when you, they go so far out. It's like, just what? it's just fancier. Cincinnati athletes are headed to the Olympics. We're going to give it to myself. Bonus points if I don't draw the rings. And I didn't, Tanner. Give her the points. The Tri-State is being represented in the Olympics. Yes. We know this. So athletes many that call our area people. home include six Cincinnati Bearcats, which I think is super cool. Very. Soccer star Rose Lavelle and Lawrenceburg High School. I didn't know this one. Lawrenceburg yeah. High School alum Mason Paris. Paris. What's he doing? Paris is a wrestler. Uh, big a wrestler. time, big time wrestler. Paris and Paris. Super cool. Unbelievable. Can we see an Eiffel Tower? That's a good, that's a good shot right there. Let's do a comparison because I think it is pretty oh, close. 
You know, it's which one's the drawing? Is that the drawing? Look, look close. Is that the drawing? Look close. I think that's the drawing, right there. See, I even nailed the bottom. There's the drawing. Oh, it is so close. I feel like I was whisked away to Paris. I actually made. I did a good job. You today. did great today. I think I'm turning a corner. Yep. Just turned, turned, took that leaf, flipped it right <laughs> over. That's what you did. I feel awkward with you sitting and me standing, though. Oh, okay. I'll stand. Come on up. Okay. Sure, you can stop watching, but let's be honest, you want to know more. Tap the links or even better, click subscribe to stay in the know.